Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 23 of Land of the Midnight Sun here in Upi Universalis 4 where unfortunately I forgot to record the start of this episode. Um, no worries though, not much has happened. Um, basically we just started a war with Great Britain. It's been pretty easy. Um, Great Britain's fairly decimated at this point so it's not been much trouble at all. Um, you do see there's a bit of trouble here uh, because this 29,000 English army was stuck in Kent while I was sieging London. And for some reason, France gave them mill access. So I was going around wiping little 1k stacks, and um, they were able to just walk around and grab this stack. So hopefully I can retreat out of this and they don't just get wiped, but they're probably just going to get wiped. Um, I mean, I could try to save them, but like it doesn't really feel worth it. Yeah, they just got wiped. Okay. Um, so that's annoying. It's fine, though. Sorry about uh, missing the beginning of this episode, but like I said, not much has been missed. We didn't get the peace deal or anything. I did alt F4 once because I was very confused about how that army got out of Kent. Um, but yeah, it turns out they just got mill access from... from England. Uh, from France. For some, for some reason, France gave them mill access. I don't know why. Um, I'm gonna build up my army back here, at least the infantry. Um, and once we get England, uh, once we get London sieged, we'll go in with both of our stacks. I've also been deving a bit. Okay, please don't gale them. Please don't siege that. Uh, so yeah, we had a small fight with the English navy. It was very tough, um, and we're about to have another one because Gilda wants to siege that province. So that's fun. Go with both. We managed to win. I think they're gonna run to Devon. Yep, we're blocking it again. And was that a wipe? That did appear to be a wipe. And we also, um, Aragon and Austria are both in this war as well. Uh, Aragon's in this war who has a personal union over Austria. Um, so, that's a thing, too. I have a problem to we can convert ourselves. Let's do that. And we've just been uh, converting for our subjects and whatnot. Not much was missed. Uh, sorry again about forgetting to record. <laughs> Very unfortunate when that happens. And we are at max admin, so I need to spend some of it. We're about to do a but uh, we're about to get a bunch of land, so I'm gonna save it to core. I could take the tech, technically, but it'd be way ahead of time. Uh, do you really not want to peace out? Hmm. And uh, for the peace deal, we're just gonna go for all of Ireland, which is everything we have claims on, and then I'm also gonna grab these provinces over here. Um, a native vassal that England got in the New World, so that'll finish off that colony, which would be nice. Um, yeah, England's navy's not gonna have anywhere to go after this, right? I can still go to Aragon, but we're gonna lose, aren't we? Yep, still can't beat that English navy, even though we outnumber them dramatically in terms of heavies and um, just pure numbers. Alright, I'm gonna get some buildings going, because I'm not really gonna be helping out with Aragon, it appears. <laughs> um, let's see, we got some good workshops here, potentially. Or decent ones, at least. Um, okay, any manufactories that would be good to build? There's one, there's one. There's one. Okay. Spend all the money. Because why not? And let me get a couple of uh, cannons built. As well. I also want to see how Portuguese Mexico is looking. This is another war we'll have to do somewhat soon. And yeah, it's just annoying not being able to fight them by my own merit. Like, just with that 40k. It's a pretty annoyingly big colonial nation over there. But we are going to be able to call Portugal into that. 
Or, sorry, Songhai into that war with Portugal. Okay, so these guys are peace off. Could we manage to get you to end your alliance with Great Britain? They're close. I think I'll wait and let that... I'll let that happen. Because uh, in, and ending that alliance on um, Great Britain's end would be pretty cool. Or not Aragon's end, sorry. And there we go. We can do that now. We can even take a decent bit of money from them. Alright, so that should be this war basically over. And I'll take all your money, too. Well, as much as I can, anyway. <laughs> Alright. So this should all pop over to New Scandinavia. Yep, or Vinland, the appropriate ones. And we should be able to go ahead and core all this. So let's see if I can, um... Concentrate Devadol. Now, who, what is this? Catholic Zealots? Okay, well, you're not my Catholic Zealots, so you should leave. Right? Are you not gonna leave? <laughs> and my navy got decimated again, which we love to see. Very cool. I'm not sure if I want to go right towards Portugal or not. I guess we might as well. Um, Portugal's allied Bengal. Kind of annoying, but I don't think Bengal will actually get over here. So I think it'll be fine. We're just going to load these guys onto the ships and just go ahead and prepare the invasion. Um, they shouldn't be able to resist it that much. Okay, so I'm going to send you over here. Those real quick with our marines. Alright, let's go ahead and get this moving down. How many ships do you have? 54, so we should be fine on that. And they're, I think, at war in Indonesia, that will be or, or something. I think I'll just do this one. <laughs> feels like it's easier. <laughs> Bay of Feta? Where is that even? There it is. Yeah, it feels like it's an easier war goal to have. So I'm just gonna go for that one. This music is very calm, <laughs> considering, you know, war. Um, right, and these guys are just going to go and, and start trying to um, take stuff from Portuguese Mexico, because that's where they get a lot of their war scores from. You are going to go back and start ferrying these guys over as soon as the beachhead is established. Cool. I'll let all of those finish up. It's gonna be pretty easy to occupy their mainland. Um, Songhai doesn't seem to be doing much right now. They're just getting occupied themselves. Thank you, Songhai. Very cool, very helpful. Miltech? I'll take Miltech ahead of time. I don't care. Um, these armies have no cav. I don't think even if I update my troops right now, they'll be bold enough to attack me. I'm just gonna do it. I don't think they're. I don't think they're like that. I don't think they're built, built like that. 
and also the um, calves, but we don't have calves in our army. Okay, so this needs to be converted, right? No, it doesn't actually. We can just go ahead and trade company that. Cool. And then we'll send a guy here. Also get a debate in our parliament. Well, we can't gain a stab, so that's why. Um, trade efficiency and stuff sounds good. I'll go through and do some of these easy ones. Um, let's see, can you some of my papal influence? Um, okay, that's all I'll do. 69% chance. I'll take it. Yeah, obviously, I'll hold off on engaging until our morales come back. And, uh, by I mean, I'm gonna take as much of Mexico as I can. I probably can't get it all in one war. Probably can't hit the concede option on them. Um, nope. I can have them personally concede Suma. That's it. So we're just going to have to go through and be like, hey, I'm going to take a bunch of Mexico like this. <laughs> and my Mexican colony is once again going to be having a very bad time, but uh, I don't care. Just realizing I probably should have declared war on Mexico directly. That probably would have get, gotten me better results. <laughs> um, Overall. Is there any other stuff I want to I'll take that thing in Africa, I guess. Maybe this province in Oceania. Oh yeah, we need to take this as well. I don't want you having this. I want all of Guinea. Papa Papa New Guinea. I want all of it. All these islands. We love islands. I'm a big fan. I'll take this little thing here they got. Okay. Just decimate their colonial empire. Very cool. Um, and you know what? Screw it. Let's just make Mexico have a bad time. Why not? I love bullying my own Mexican colonial subject by giving them way more land than they could ever possibly support taking in a single war. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not? Why not? I'm gonna hate it, <laughs> but I'm gonna do it anyway. We might not do 100% because uh, it's kind of hard to get 100% on these guys. Okay, so one more month and we should be good here. We're just gonna box them in on each side, like that. Oh, okay, they've changed color and name. Cool. Any stuff here we can grab? None that I need. Let's go help out Mexico real quick. Go about Mexico a bit more. Okay, never mind. What is this? Songhai, what are you doing out here, man? Songhai, where is. He says you have 62,000 men. Why are 22,000 just standing in Nupe? Not even at war with Nupe. Okay, there's a lot of rebels in Mexico right now. And uh, we've not even... We've not even given them a ridiculous amount of land they could never possibly support having. Wow. Uh, do I... I um, I'm just gonna go ahead and take it. 25% at a time. I don't have anything else to do with admin power. And that gets us another idea group, so it'll be something I can spend my admin on. Um, let's go eco. Why not? Let's 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 make money. Let's make money, big money. Uh, but yeah, eco seems like a good choice there. Just make uh, some more money. All right, and now we're just—I don't know where the, those twenty thousand Portuguese went. Uh, I would imagine they just uh, went down south. Something. And keep converting over here. All right. There's this boa down. Oh, 
hopefully Avora. Yep, there's Avora down. Nice. And we got trading in clothes. Very cool. We're about to have some separatists in Ireland. Not so cool. And Portugal is just pushing into Songhai like crazy. Also not so cool. Songhai, why do you have 22,000 men just sitting in Nupe? They're not doing anything down there. Get them out. Um, okay, I'm going to quickly send... I'm going to quickly send these guys back to Ireland to handle this incoming revolt. Um, you guys can go up here and clear out some of the Portuguese in Mexico. I still have... You know, I might as well just take these. Like, I might as well just spin my people influence on something. Increase my mercantilism, why not? Songhai, you're killing me. Okay, you finally... Okay, now they're just sitting here. Okay. It's not much better, new bit. Uh, it's not much better, Songhai. Keep it a buck. Where are you coming? Where are these two provinces? Um, probably Limerick, I would guess. Get our like a trade idea. I'll just wait to tech up on that. Okay, you having fun? Fine. You want to do this? You want to play this game? Fine. Your stupid little 35k or 35 ships. Oh, cool. National tax modifier. Very cool. We should have these Irish cores finishing up very soon. Okay, and you get down here. Onto the ships. And down guards. I don't care if you oppose. Okay, so that's all that stuff done. Not there. Wait, wait is there nowhere else I can state? <laughs> oh. And we'll start converting um, Ireland. So that's worked really well historically, right? Probably, I don't know if we're going to be able to wrap this war with Portugal in this episode. Um, just because, you know, um, it's so annoying fighting these big colonial wars. That I have to focus on these two fronts. Or these, not, not fronts, two continents. <laughs> um... And uh, they really get a lot of war score out of their subjects. Out of their colonial subjects, which I think is dumb. I think they get way too much war score out of colonial subjects. Um, like, if I have them full occupied in Europe, it really shouldn't matter if they have, like, a colonial subject with a bunch of Mexico. In fact, that colonial subject should probably just, like, rebel at that point. Alright, here's Infertile. Very cool. Alright, um... I just kinda need to go and carpet siege and move on. Okay, so we know that there's some Portuguese troops up here. I feel like I just need to get the south of Mexico carpet siege with my marines here just to get some of that war score from it.
Really? Okay, so... These guys peaced out. Cool. Song High was a complete disappointment there. Okay, we need to watch the outliner here so I can see when these armies are done sieging. And then send them sieging more. Okay, thank you, Sayuda. Love sieging Sayuda. Very cool. Honestly, um, no. I'm hard treatmenting all of you. Because I can't be bothered to go back and deal with this right now. Sayuda. Very cool. Love sieging Sayuda. And then there go the Portuguese coming back. Because they're it's a literal robot I'm playing against. I'm playing against a literal robot who can keep track of all of this stuff far better than I can. Please just get Sayuda, I'm begging you. I'll go grab the police and this guy will come in after you. What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh. I swear to God, if I lose naval superiority. <laughs> okay, cool. I mean, you get there and push that navy out as quick as we can. I need to mess them up while they're still low. Definitely don't want our mill guy dying right now. Um, discipline, yes, please. Tech. Increases our naval morale right ahead of a naval fight. Very cool. You need to be converted. Um, okay. Let's send them here. Big Killwa. Well, kind of. They don't have M Mutapa. They've not got rid of those guys, but. Wait, can we just hit him again? No. That's fine. I want you all to converge here and go back in on Portugal up here. I'm getting impatient here. Um, let's get these done, huh? They don't have many forts left and that'll be everything they have that's not colonial land basically occupied. You're giving me mill access, right? What are you going to? Okay, I've got a merchant unassigned. Um, I don't think I've been doing enough over here in Indonesia yet. Let's send one here. Okay. And you... Yes, you... It up big time. I'll just go carpet, siege, all of this back. And then we'll go focus back on the south while our Mexican subjects focusing on the north. ASAP. I want you splitting into threes. Get all this down. You going over here because that's where their navy's gonna flee to. We can beat it up again. Hopefully before they can recover much. Okay, so 
believe if they're gonna go anywhere now, they're gonna go all the way down here. Um, that's where we're going to. Okay. You get down there. We captured the Portuguese flagship. Very cool. Did we just kill Portuguese Portugal's whole navy? Not all of it, but most of it. Alright, and you've gotten that, so now I want you all to go down here. So we've got how many armies here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Oh, wait, we can get another one. Okay. Um, so I sent you there. Wait, did I already send one here? So you're going there. You're going there. You're going there. Okay, so you need to not go there. Go to Honduras. And you're going there, so we need one in between those right there. And then you go here, and you go here. Saw the rest of their navy. It's actually right here, so I'm gonna go over there. Lock it in. And Portugal's just going on a run. Okay. Bengal actually showed up. Are you serious? Are you for real? Okay. This is dumb. Did Bengal literally just walk from India to North Africa? Are you for real? <laughs> I mean, hats off to him, I suppose. Please get up there before they recapture that fort. I'm begging you. Okay, you actually stay here and we'll just split you... Oh, so he's going to all of this. Jesus Christ, they're showing up in numbers. Please, please get there. Please get there. I'm begging you, don't, don't let them win the siege. Please, thank God. Okay, we literally just stack wiped an army of yours, Bengal. Can you just like not? No. Okay. I want more of this, I guess. These guys have all done their carpet sieging missions. Let's send you here, here, here. Actually, you should go here. You there. No. Let's get the south covered. Great, and there's peasants. Can't be having that because I can't be losing the occupations. Um, okay, so I'm gonna send. I'm gonna split you in half too, and we're gonna start sending. We're here to carpet siege this all back. All right, let's get all that army back together. We have the south fully occupied. Okay, where are those Bengal armies? We're over here. Do you really not want a piece out of this, my guy? I literally stack wipe one of your armies so easily. Okay. He doesn't. It's his choice, I suppose. Okay, and they're separatists. As soon as I leave, they're separatists. Carpet siege that. Man, these are always so annoying. <laughs> Can I just say that? These these big colonial wars. 
Just the worst. Without a doubt. Alright, let's start converting for our subjects again. There's so much war score just sitting in colonies. If Songhai goes, if Bengal goes and picks off one of my little armies here. That's exactly what they're doing, isn't it? Don't. Don't you dare. Okay, cool. Should be another stack wipe. And uh, hopefully you're willing to see reason now. Wasn't quite a stack wipe. Come on, man. Just, what are you gaining from this? What are you gaining from this? <laughs> would you please elaborate and tell me? I would love, I would love for you to tell me what exactly it is you're gaining from this. Where are they even fleeing to? Oh, right here. Great. Everyone's being. S this is the most annoying thing ever that Bengal allied Portugal and joined this war. <laughs> Are you for real? <laughs> oh, that was an easy stack, right? Easy stack wipe. Okay, well, there's more separatists, so get back up here and kill them. Where are you even going? Should you go there? Let me go here. Please, Bengal. Thank you. Could you please stop allying Portugal? Is that possible at all? No. Okay, I don't care. Just get him out. <laughs> that is incredibly annoying. And we're going to have to fight Portugal again, so it's only to get more annoying. Okay. Why are you calling me into this, man? Why are you calling me into this? Oh, wow, that was nice. Good job calling me in, Poland. It's gonna immediately peace out. <laughs> nice call. Yeah, I'm not fighting that right now. Are you insane? See what I'm dealing with right here? I mean, it's not that hard. It's just annoying, but it's a lot for me to deal with. <laughs> uh, Portugal, please. Can you just, like, see reason? Is that too much to ask? Portugal, come on, man. It's over. Just accept it. Fine, I'll take a little bit less of Mexico, okay? I'll take a little bit less of Mexico, and I will have you no, no longer be allied to Bengal. How about that? There we go. And that's that war over. France is, uh, Mexico is about to be dying, <laughs> for the record. But, uh, hey, it is what it is. This is not the Mexican scan this is not the Mexican colonial region. We'll sort that out in the next episode and get our, all of our armies back home. So uh, thank you much for watching everyone. Hope you all enjoyed. Hope to see you all in the next one. Bye.